Media nowadays, in terms of getting your message in front of people, is a massively fragmented market. Okay, so gone are the, the, the days of Mad Men where you put a, an ad on TV, radio, or press, and you go to the bar for the rest of the day. Okay, there's so many different options. Um, TV, video, email, website, event speaking, content, display, ex exhibitions, product placement, personal selling, sales promotion, as in buy one, get one free type of stuff. Bloggers talking about your stuff. Uh, trade, getting pushing it into the trade. Social media, apps, remarketing, as in you know those freaky ads that follow you around on the web mm -hmm. after you've been on Aer Lingus or something? Remarketing. Sponsorship events, radio, mobile, guerrilla, shopper marketing, as in in-store merchandising. Boo means out of home, so billboard, billboards, buses. Uh, native advertising, so those ones that disguise themselves as an article, but it's actually an ad, okay? Uh, direct mail, search, paid search, organic search, location-based, pure. So your head will spin, it's like a game of Twister, and we would have a media planning department within our business. And as you can imagine, within each one of them, you have hundreds of options as well, okay? So, where do you start? Firstly, in terms of media, um, certain media have, are better at other things than other media. So in terms of broadcasting messages to quite a large audience, obviously the likes of TV, radio, press, big display ads, maybe on RT or The Independent or Joe Dolly, gets your message out there. So that's where the big brands go to announce new product launches, that type of thing. There's also other really hyper-personalized type of for example, direct mail, email, uh, social media, which could be directed, where you can actually have a conversation with people. So there's some that are better at others. And um, there's also three types of media um, within the world. There's the media that you pay for, okay? So that's putting your ads on the back of a bus, or in a magazine, or on a radio. There's media that you own. So these are your vans, your website, your shop front, so you can put the media up there, and then the most powerful media of all in this day and age is earned media, okay? So this is when people talk about you, share yourself, uh, evaluate, uh, give you five stars, all that kind of thing. So it's paid, owned, earned. Obviously the most, the more earned you can get, and particularly if you're a small business trying to get a little bit of PR, people talking about you, people saying how great you are, it's worth quite a lot. And also saves you have to pay money. So whenever we do campaigns for the likes of Temple Street Hospital or Barrettstown or these guys, funds are absolutely limited. So we try to create these really highly emotive stories, uh, maybe tweet them out, get maybe a couple of celebrities trying to talk about it, get that sort of art. Okay, so there's potential there.